Capricorn, what's up? Welcome to my channel. Am I tripping or not, Tarot? My name is Cock Frost, but you can call me the Ghetto Nun. So, Cappy, I'm here to do your October slash general slash love reading, my G. I do cuss in my readings and give no fucks about it, so if you do, please get the fuck on. I do start all of my cards upright in my deck. I don't believe in starting out with reversals because that's some bullshit. Also, I did pre-shuffle, but I did not lay any cards down just yet. Cappy, we gonna do it together. Please keep in mind this may or may not resonate with every single Capricorn getting no fit thugs. Info for private readings will be below the video. Please take the time to check out our community board. It's like the farmer's market for all the nuns and high priests where they have their businesses, purposes, gifts, etc., etc. posted. If you'd like to submit your business for the bulletin board, please check the info in the description box below the video. If you find that the convent is not for you, please look for the nearest exit mark. Get the fuck on. Watch hand on the way out. Hit the alley. You'll be back in two then. Thank you to everyone for all the bookings, donations, likes, subscribes, comments, shares, purchases, and pledges to Patreon. I love you. All right, Cappy. I'm excited to do your readings now. I mean, I have been for a while, but just like I am about Scorpio. Even though I'm like Libra gang, but I'm mostly Scorpio gang. But it's something about y'all, Cappy. I say it every time. You can have Scorpio in your chart. Uh, they're showing me uh, the other tarot reader, Flavor Vivid. She's one of my favorite people. I love your energy, girl. If you are watching my video, I love you so much. Y'all check out Flavored Vivid. I think you are uh, a Capricorn, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not even a Capricorn. I just love y'all, though. It's something about y'all. Anyway. Capricorn. Uh, you may be dishing out... Uh, I don't want to say you're dishing out karma to people, Capricorn, and, but you're like karma's bailiff, okay? Karma's like correctional officer and shit. It's like you put the cuffs on people in October in regards to karma. So you may be reflecting things back to people. You're like going to make people feel stupid, Capricorn, basically, uh, in Libra season. Or people may be making you feel stupid, but I really fucking doubt it, G. This is saying you're going to be making people feel real dumb. Uh, I don't know if you're trying to do this, but they said it is your duty. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know. You said duty. I don't know. Somebody's goofy out here, too. Uh, they gave you the damn keys to the cuffs, huh, Capricorn? Okay. You may be in a goofy mood, Capricorn, kind of up and down, like, kind of, like, lighthearted, but still serious at the same time. Ooh, what are your candles went out, Booski? No, no. Ooh, two of your candles went out, Booski? No. So, shoot. A relationship could be over with the water sign, Capricorn? Uh, some eternal flame was not eternal, I heard. So you could be listening. Oh, yeah, something just unexpectedly, unexpectedly happened, Capricorn. It could be a breakup or something like that. I'm sorry, Booski. Well, I still would like to have a candlelit. I mean, we can't have dinner, but a candlelit reading with you. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, Capricorn. You my last reading and my damn battery is done. And I'm sitting here acting like we got all the time in the world. Like we could just chop it up. Somebody could be having a chop salad, lamb chops, chop suey, I heard. Or shit, somebody getting chopped the fuck off. I'm telling you, uh, Capricorn, you setting some shit, right? Okay, let's get started. I'm three damn minutes, Capricorn, just, yeah. All right, give me some messages uh, for Cappy in October, please. Yeah, you see shit. Clear vision. This high definition. Some of you guys could have just gotten a new TV or some type of new device uh, or could be needing to get a new device or something like that. Updated. An update may be needed, needed. Capricorn. Excuse me. This is seeing something very clearly, though, Capricorn. Yeah, that blows your mind or that blows other people's mind. Something like that. Some of you guys are going to be surprised at something that you see. Or someone's going to be surprised when they see you. Some of you guys could be doing something different. Or someone, uh, some of you guys could be in the spotlight. I heard um, someone may have a cameo on a show. Uh, is what this is. And somebody's surprised like when they see you on TV. Like, there they are. Uh, or some shit like that. I used to do that shit. I used to be on the OC, Boston Public, the Bernie Mac show. All type of shit. You wouldn't know it was me, though, because I'm in the back. Uh, nobody looks for that person. But this is this type of shit, an extra. Somebody may be doing extra work or something and someone actually notices who you are. Every now and then, but you have to tell, mommy, that's me. Don't look at what's going on with the people. You got to look behind the people. That is me with the wine glass. That's me. <laughs> Somebody, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm happy to see you, Cappy. I'm proud of you even if you're just standing there with the wine glass, okay? Something about props. You guys could be getting ready for Halloween, decorating. Or something like that. Give me something for a Capricorn. Ooh, the star came out reversed. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. Uh, somebody sees an Aquarius that they don't want to see. 
Like, I never want to fucking see your fucking face again. Or this is, um, <laughs> this could be a spiritualist. This could be, you could be a spirit. Yes, um, you could be a spiritualist, do tarot or something like that. Some of you guys do not want to deal with certain people. Like, I see how you get down. Uh, you don't need healing. You need fucking therapy. You know what I mean? You need a fucking tranquilizer gun and shit. Like, but it's your duty to tell these people that. So what it feels like Capricorn is like people trust your advice uh, they try, you know what I mean? They come to you for like, and you give good advice, but I feel like people are expecting you to sugarcoat shit. Okay. It ain't Christmas motherfucker. This ain't sugar cookies. Okay. Said Capricorn. Fuck that. Uh, you need help. You need to see a fucking doctor. Okay. Somebody may need to see a doctor, but I feel like this is what you're telling someone Capricorn. Like, honestly, pretty pink baby blue, teach me something new. This may be someone coming to you for help or something. And you ain't in no position to do it. Or that's not my fucking job. G. It's not my fucking job to watch your children. You need a fucking babysitter. Do I look like... It's like, no, I'm not what you need. This is what you need, says Capricorn. Ooh, Cappy. Somebody's eyes may be... Somebody may need to get their eyes checked. Go see an eye doctor. Or someone has like a sick spirit out here. Like a spiritually transmitted disease out here. Heavy on this air. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Heavy on the Aquarius. Okay, what the hell, Cappy Janet? Let's go. The path to righteousness. Yeah, it feels like you're separating. It could be water. Didn't I say that earlier? I think I did. I don't know. This is somebody separating from somebody. Uh, to the, I, This came out in a, a collective reading, didn't it? Or I think so. Um, it's like where one person's going the right way and another person just gave the fuck up. You know what I mean? It's like you're on some fuck ass shit. Like your spirit is dirty. You're dirty. You need help. I'm out of here, says Capricorn or cross watcher. Someone saw something or see something in someone Capricorn and it makes them like dip the fuck out. Like I do not want to talk to you. I'm good on your ass. Heavy water out here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aquarius. Someone claimed that they were a righteous person or a good person. High vibing and all this shit. Uh, I feel like their spirit, something about their spirit alarmed you Capricorn, but you may have still kept moving on or working with this person or doing something with this person. But I feel like that was it. Maybe you find out something or found something. Yep. Airing out dirty laundry. I know what the fuck I be talking about, G. Uh, Capricorn. Okay. Just keep swimming. Dory energy. Yeah. You just keep moving on Capricorn and you will in October. Even if you don't feel good some days. This is saying, like, I don't feel good. I don't feel like doing this shit. I don't feel... You know what I mean? But you still do it, though, Capricorn. You know? Like, you uh, lead by example, Capricorn, in October. Even if you don't feel like it, G. Okay? Aww. Anywho, let's keep going, Capricorn. Put something on the high definition. Why is this here for Cappy in October? Yeah, TV breaks or a device falls in some water, Capricorn. Be careful. It's not, you can't repair it. So if this is like an iPhone or a computer, laptop, tablet, uh, earbud, that shit's done. You're going to have to get a new one. Or if someone loses something like on a boat, like something could fall in the ocean or a lake, you're not going to get that back. You never see it a fucking again, okay? It's, it's gone, okay? One on the um, high definition. Three of swords. Yeah, something broken. Somebody may kick a TV as well or destroy a TV. This feels a little violent. I told you air. Libra, Aquarius. Heavy Aquarius. Uh, somebody out here is a fallen star. That's the star card reverse. But I feel like literally though, like like a celebrity that's doing bad. You know what I mean? That fell off or actor, influencer. Somebody that's aging out the game or... This could be someone you separated from as well, Capricorn, that wants to reconcile and you don't. This motherfucker at home don't, destroying their own property and shit. Or just having a temper tantrum or some shit you wouldn't know because you kept swimming. Shout out to Australia and shit. Okay? But you kept swimming is what this is. Somebody out here is hurt. Uh, their spirit is hurt. I feel like someone may have hurt your feelings, hurt you, Capricorn, but you kept on swimming. And I feel like you're in no, I mean, I feel like whatever you went through is painful or will be or has been. I feel like you already moved on from this. You see what something is, you gone already. And I feel like it was painful. This uh, pain that you felt, whatever this is, is being returned to whoever gave you this pain. And they just at home destroying their own shit, G. Drowning in their sorrows, I heard. That's what the fuck they get. Or you, Capricorn, whoever did this shit. 
It's like they can dish it, but they can't take it type shit, Cappy. Okay? Someone sees you uh, and they're hurt at what they see. Someone can tell that, that they fucked you over, Capricorn, and you can tell. Someone know, or they know they fucked themselves. Someone may know, like, they see the future, like, I know what's coming because I did Capricorn like this or something. Especially if you're a spiritualist or you deal, deal in spirituality, a medium, connect to spirits, intuition, and somebody tried to fuck with you, Capricorn, and they knew this, they saw this in high fucking definition and still decided to stab you in the fucking heart? Somebody's spirit guys is ready to turn the fuck up. This the spirit guy car on their way, and this ain't the good ones. I mean, shit, everybody knows, you know? Well, not everybody, but we do have different, like, some of the light, some of the dark. Some are warriors, some are peacemakers. In regards to spirit guys, ancestors, angels, we should know that. This feel like the kind that come fuck shit up, Capricorn, okay? So whoever you messed up with or that messed up with you, they on they ass, Mr. Post. That's why this motherfucker kicking their TV in. Your ancestors are sitting there laughing and shit. Like, destroy your own shit, motherfucker. Stop destroying my people, okay? Let my people go. This person may have been trying to hold on to your energy. You may have set this person free mentally or tried to. Capricorn, or they did. Somebody just was like, I want to stay here with captivity and shit. And you're like, oh, okay. They didn't have to hurt you in the process. That's the fucking problem. Free will is cool, but don't be uh taking away mine. You know what I'm saying? Don't fucking lie to me and make me make choices based on what the fuck you telling me. And it's a fucking lie, bitch, says Capricorn. Yeah, you real testy. You may kick somebody in the testies. <laughs> Damn, Capricorn, don't do it. Why did I say that? Don't do that. Somebody is pissed the fuck off out here, Capricorn, in October. I feel like that's normally not your style or this person's style. That's why they said lead by example, Capricorn, but... Because if you kick somebody in the testes, everybody will start kicking people in the testes. And you done started a whole phase, a whole fad and shit on TikTok. Uh, the testy TikTok and shit. I don't know. Dang it, Cappy. Hold on. Yeah, come on, baby. Light my fire. Everything you drop is so tired. Music is supposed to inspire. So how come we ain't getting no higher? Yeah, so how come we're... She, that was Lauren Hill. It's like, how come we're not getting any better then? Like, you know what I mean? I give to you, you give to me. Like, or you say you're doing this, but how come it's not getting... You say you're at work, but your check says zero, zero, zero fucking dollars. Like, that's not how work works. You know what I mean? You go there, they give you a paycheck. It's like something's off. Like, I feel like somebody is a blatant fucking liar out here, Capricorn, on some real shit. Like, I feel like this motherfucker just lied to your face or you did this. This person is about to uh, be under judgment or karma or something in October. They already can feel it coming. This person could have arthritis or bad joints, either in their arms, knees, elbows. Yeah, I knew it was a motherfucking man, but I was just waiting. Or this could have happened to a man, but this is your energy here, Capricorn. I told you somebody hurt my booski. The fuck? Um, and you saw everything. I don't know if you found some evidence and it was clear what the fuck was going on. This high definition. It's like, bitch, you gonna now my eyes lying, bitch. I feel like Capricorn, somebody tries to insult your intelligence or they did you. Okay. And I feel like it, it almost made you jump out of your higher self. Cause this is the star reverse. Like I'll abandon this whole Quran, Bible, spirituality, divine shit and whoop your kick you straight in the test. G says, but you don't. Because you already know, you see where that'll get you when you do things like that. But I damn sure feel like you're thinking it, damn it, Capricorn. But you still keep moving the right way. But fuck you pissed off. Or somebody else. Okay? You damn sure keep it moving, though. It is you. You go back to work. You stay stable. You stable, restabilize. You heal your heart. Whatever it is, you may buy some things that make you comfortable or make you feel well. Like shopping and shit like that. Or uh, something. You may buy a pet or something. It's something you're going to do when this happens to make yourself feel better or like you're going to help someone. That's the way like I, when I want to fuck somebody up, I usually go help somebody uh, or God put somebody in. I don't usually go. I'm, a, I'm lying. I'm lying like a motherfucker. I don't go try to help nobody, but God put somebody in my path for me to help. Yeah, Because I'll be pissed the fuck off. I don't be looking for no shit. God be like, I know how to fix that attitude, miss ma'am. Right? Put a homeless person right there, look right at me, like, excuse me, excuse me, I have nothing. Like, you know what I mean? This type of shit. Like, okay. Like, people are worse off. It could be worse, none. It could be worse, Cappy. So that's what keeps you going on. You lead by example, G. You know? Even though you want to kick this motherfucker in the testes, G. They keep saying that. Mm hmm. 
I don't condone that, but there may be a masculine that needs to get like a prostate exam or something, testicular cancer or something with his balls, G. I don't know. Give me one with Capricorn. Put one on the King of Pentacles. That's you, Cappy. Hang man. Could be a Pisces out here. I said water. Yeah. Pisces could be moving on. Uh, Aquarius, Pisces, Cusper out here. Male out here. Could be getting hurt by someone. A uh, Pisces, I mean Aquarius, Pisces, Cusper out here. Masculine energy is about to be hurt by something he sees or finds out or some shit. Or you're about to be hurt by this man. I don't know, Cappy, okay? For some of you. Others of you, y'all stay with this man or stay with this woman. Y'all may have lived together and shit. This person want to reconcile. You de fuck, do not. Like, stay your ass away, you fucking rat. I don't know, Cappy. I feel like you are, uh... I don't know. I feel like you're like mafia. I don't know. What's going on here? Like, I don't want to see nobody get hurt. Nobody move. Nobody get hurt. I don't know, Cappy. It's like, man, and I've been talking about your beautiful kids, but I saw this coming in the last reading, Cappy. Because I was like, man, Cappy, you're gradually changing. Like, this reading isn't as great as the others. You're usually really, man, they better stop fucking with you. It feel like uh, Incredible Hurt Hope is just getting greener and greener and greener. Like, your clothes are fucking ripping off. I don't know, Cappy. Please calm the fuck down. But I feel like you do, though. I do. Put one on the path to righteousness. Let's see. Someone may be trying to stop your money. A Pisces, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Aquarius could be trying to stop your money, Capricorn, or you are doing this to somebody. They can't do it, though. You already know this about someone trying to stop your money. It's a fuck-ass, dirty-ass, spiritualist tarot reader out here and shit that's trying to stop someone's money. That could be in tarot land or some shit like that. Uh, this bitch heart hurt every time she see you do something, or yours does, Capricorn. It's a bitter-ass uh, spiritualist out here. So this is somebody who thinks you're gone. So you could disappear. You know, like sometimes people take breaks or we don't show up exactly when we say we are at the time and all this other shit. And somebody gets ahead of themselves like, <laughs> I got <'em." laughs> you know, it's like this type of motherfucker. And then you pop out on that shit or wherever it is. Uh, it could be a Sagittarius. I almost said that Capricorn social media, whatever it is. And they see your ass and I'm talking about they fuck they ass up. It fuck them up. They all, I don't know if there's somebody doing work and they think it works or you do. I don't know. It's, it's laughable. It is. It's fucking up their money and everything. They spirit, if you have a spiritual business, it's fucking up. Some of you guys can have a spiritual business. You may need to tend to this, uh, Capricorn or someone does. I don't like the star reverse with the King of Pentacles. If it's a spiritual business or you're an influencer or in the spotlight, like you may need to make a new song or put some more workout or something like that. Uh, or something. Some of you guys may be laying low just because you may be going through something though, Capricorn, but something is suffering as a result of this. I do feel like you can straighten it out, whatever it is, but just know. So this could be like, uh, I don't feel like doing shit. You know, the laundry pile is just going to get bigger and bigger. Eventually you will sort it out, but damn, you're going to run through all your soap, all your fabric softeners, all your bleach, all your dryers. It's like, now you're going to use everything up. So maybe you, that's how you guys work better. You know what I mean? Maybe you work better under pressure. Like, I'm just going to use it all, do it all, and boom, it's all done. Some method to your madness, Kathy. I don't know. I don't want to get in the devil head. I don't. Put something on the uh, path to righteousness. Yeah, your ancestors. This is my ancestors card. Some of you guys could live in a home that was given to you by your family. Uh, Capricorn, something could be passed down to you. But this is a lot of spirits, a spiritual activity in someone's home. Uh, is what this is. This is also someone moving on after being betrayed. Uh, heavy on this Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Pisces. Yes. Something's definitely, your ancestors are stopping something. This is ancestors stopping something. Some man, someone at work, somebody and shit from hurting something, Capricorn. I'm telling, I just said this in another reading. I said, you guys may see shit happen to people and you're going to know your ancestors fuck they ass up. You don't say anything though. I feel like, again, you just keep moving and shit. Yeah. Don't lose your head worrying about where they head went. Okay. Cappy, that's what anybody I'm telling you. They said you are uh karma's bailiff. They're showing me a uh, night court. So you could be dealing with a Libra. Remember that show night court and bull was the uh, bailiff, the big ass dude. I can't remember what his real name is, but uh, the tall ass dude. If you ever watch Night Court and you are like, you know what I mean? Uh, up in that age range, right? You know what I'm talking about. Uh, that's how they're showing me. His name was Bull. You could be dealing with the Taurus uh, or this could be a Taurus. But yes, G. 
they keep saying karma's bailiff. Karma's bailiff. So yeah, like you send the motherfuckers off to jail. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? I, I have the fucking key to let you in and out this bitch. Ooh, Kathy, I like it. Spicy. Put one on the uh high definition three of swords. Cause I don't want my shit to cut out, Kathy. And that's way too many. Damn it, Bobby. Steel magnolias. Exactly, G. I heard don't let the smooth taste fool you. Damn, now you drink malt liquor now too? <laughs> Capricorn, damn. This is, uh, you don't look like how you are, Capricorn. So this is somebody that could just be like, pretty face, cute this, cute that. It's a beast in there, G. Especially when somebody hurts you, hurts your children, hurt your family, hurt your loved ones, come for your money. It's like somebody may be coming for you and, uh, and it could be a man trying to come back, a woman, something. They're trying to come for your business stability. I feel like because people underestimate you, Capricorn, or this is you, someone else. And I mean, they gonna see, I mean, fuck. Like, it's almost like, are they still spiritual or still like, are they sick or are they, no, you just can't fucking with their ass and they just, I mean, shit, Capricorn, nothing can fade the rock, they said, yeah, it's like you ripping, they showing me you ripping your shirt off, so somebody could be a wrestler or something, or Incredible Hulk, I don't know if you whoop somebody's ass, please don't, I'm seeing bar fights and shit and all type of stuff, Capricorn, and that's not your style, but you got a lot of pent up energy from whatever this is that's been going on, and it's like anybody can fuck, who want it with lean, <laughs> yeah, that was on bringing down the house with uh Steve Martin and Queen Latifah and shit, I heard who want it with lean. And let somebody own lean. It's, I don't know. Okay, leave Cappy alone. Okay. <laughs> you can have a bunch of women around you with some friends, a friend group or family or whatever. They will beat some man's ass if he come around or some woman's ass, Capricorn. It's like giving me mafia. But like, y'all don't look like that. You know what I mean? Like, but it's like, but that we're not mad people unless you come for our kids, come for this, come. Remember when Sally Field, when Julia Roberts' kidneys went down, that's when Julia, I mean, uh, Sally Field got raw. Like, nah, I'm gonna do whatever. I'm gonna give her my kidney. Like, you've never known me to do that because my daughter didn't need a kidney, but now she does and I'll die for her and shit. I'm telling you, uh, Capricorn, somebody don't know you when you uh, they said when your feet are being put to the fire, it damn sure could be a fire sign, even though it's not out here. When your feet are being put to the fire, man, I would not. Yes, dude. And I have a feeling this ain't even you, but you like, but you don't know me none. You ain't never. And I'm, I'm saying I would never come for your kids or your, your family or none of that. Not hell no. Right. But th this is why. Cause I would say the same thing. No, Cappy. I just saw your kids on the school bus a month and a half ago. You were reading to them, tucking them in bed, camping, making s'mores, combing their hair. And now you are ice cube <laughs> and boys in the, like, what happened? Somebody is going to end up going back to the hood to live there. Take you to the hood and I ain't never coming back. Uh, I don't know what that line is, but that's what they said. I don't know. Somebody can only afford to live there, though. This could be someone who does like tarot work or spiritual work or they're an influencer in the spotlight. This person is falling. I said a falling star and I said, no, it feel like a real one. Yeah, they got to move back to the hood. Whoever this is, this is like somebody washed up or something. Or somebody that you may have been with, Capricorn, or this is you. Somebody like went from a great lifestyle to a real fucked up one. And now they want to kick, <laughs> damn, this person is not that bright. Whoever this is left luxury, right? They fucked that up. Then they had to move to like, like, it looks like poverty or an impoverished place. You know what I mean? With barely anything and the barely anything they have, they kicking it and trashing it. It's like somebody that only have a TV in this like broke down ass place they live in and then gonna kick the TV. So now there's no entertainment. It's like, man, I, but I feel like your ancestors are doing this, G. Okay. You maybe so maybe that's why they're saying you don't need to get boys in the hood, uh, Capricorn, if your ancestors are, right? That's why I said we have different ancestors. I have this kind too. So you probably do too. They see, keep saying the mafia. So I don't know who y'all fuck with. Okay, Capricorn. But they feel dead. But they feel like this is what we do. Like, you know what I mean? Like, that's what we were put here. Like, I don't know. Okay. <sighs> Capricorn. Or this real life shit. I don't know. I just know I ain't fucking with you. Okay, I'm gonna wait till your shit change up when you're back with the babies baking cookies and shit. Uh, holla, holla at your own girl. But I can't be involved in this, <laughs> Capricorn. Put one on the ancestors with the path to righteousness here. Yeah, Nirvana. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. 
we know Kurt when you know what I mean that's why I feel like your ancestors are driving someone crazy G like making people like I'm telling you sending them back to poverty grunge is what this says lonely all apologies like drug ridden places like someone's being driven back not you though because ten of swords is here like no nah, you can't go there Capricorn but this motherfucker can somebody is getting karma to but it's like they're being sent back to where the fuck they came from go back with your look at you Capricorn look at you like go back over there with your punk ass mama that punk ass bitch or that punk ass man there you fucking liar right and it's like, that should be enough. But now you want to kick them in the testes and do all this other crazy shit, Capricorn. And they're saying, you should let that go, G. The, your spiritual mafia or the gang or whoever this is, the Vikings, the whoever, the uh, King Arthur's courts and shit. I don't know who these people are, okay? They're like warriors or soldiers or something. They're taking care of it. But you want to like do something physical. I want to get physical. <laughs> oh, yeah. Go work out, Capricorn. Go do some yoga aerobics. Don't put your hands on nobody. You or your friends or your family. Because it look like y'all will fuck some shit up. This is like a bunch of women. If you see like the woman that was cheating with your man, y'all will beat this bitch's ass. Okay? And everybody like, are you sure that's her? High definition. Somebody like, nah, that's that bitch. High I fucking know. And it's all bad. G. It's just, I mean, and this is not you. Are y'all with somebody like that that turns up like this? In public places and shit. Uh, and women think that's cute. Now this is aside from uh, you just like being hurting in your feelings. And may want to get physical. Which I don't condone. But this is also women that thinking that this type of shit is cute. What? Okay. Somebody all fucked up here. And they wondering why they can't tap into spiritual messages. Or become enlightened. Or manifest and shit. It's like because you like people that are destined to die. Or stay in poverty. I mean what the fuck. Why should you need that. You're not going anywhere. It's like that type of energy. Somebody is. I don't know. I got to keep moving for this phone cut out on y'all Cappy. I'll be so sorry if it. I mean I'm so sorry if it does ahead of time. Three of Wands. I would unplug it, but I don't think the sound is going to be okay. Uh, like, I knew I felt fire out here. Yeah, there's somebody waiting for some shit to Peter pop the fuck off. Like, bitch, say the fucking word. Don't let me fucking see you. But this feels like someone that hurt you, Capricorn. And it feels like you hurt your feelings. Honestly, with like, that's what this feels like. So I feel like um, you don't have to, I mean, I know it hurts and shit because you probably gave a lot to this person and you trying to like go back to the old Capricorn. Don't go back to the old Cappy G. I'm telling you. I'm grabbing the knife out your hand at the dinner table in the color purple. It ain't worth it, Missy. Like, give me the motherfucking ham knife, Capricorn. Shit, okay? He not worth it, or she. This what it feel like. Easter dinner. This was going... Oh, shit, no. Yes, this feel like something pop off if this motherfucker show up, come to your door, show up at dinner, your birthday, your kid, something, okay? People gonna pounce on whoever the fuck this is. It's a he or a she. Somebody, brothers, uncles, cousins, and shit ready to fuck somebody up. Uh, Gemini energy, Aquarius, Pisces, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy out here. Somebody down with the wrong crowd or I don't know. Uh, Libra kind of had this energy. Or no, Leo, excuse me. Leo had this energy. Three of Wands. You definitely could be dealing with one. Uh, somebody is like Capricorn. Don't call the homies, G. Okay, that's what they said. Don't call the homies. Don't call Uncle, uh, you know what I mean? Tommy, the Tommy gun, 10 finger toes, Tim, none of them people, okay? Don't call none. Don't call Ralphie. Don't call none. And don't call Baby Boo. Don't call none of these people, G. Okay, because I feel like somebody will ride for your ass, Capricorn, okay? And I don't feel like it's that serious when your spiritual team is already riding for you, but this person pissed you off. You may have waited on this person or held back doing something in your own life for this person. Ah, it's, ugh, Capricorn. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. That is you. Yeah, King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. This somebody your ass was with. This person had to go back to the streets, G. So somebody left and is going back to the streets. Somebody else is like, uh, my ancestors are taking care of this, which they are. Capricorn, this is your energy and shit. And you just may be a little irritated, depressed, feeling lonely or whatever, but you keep moving in October. I feel like you get angry. You may be going through different stages of like anger, grief, disappointment. You may be blaming yourself. Don't do any of those things and shit. 
uh, here, Capricorn. I do see you like hooking up with someone new in the future as well. If this is a love situation or a job, it's a new job or someone trying to, this could be somebody you worked with like in the spiritual community and they fucked you over and all this. Uh, fuck all that shit, Capricorn. Just don't kick nobody in the testes because please. Capricorn, I gotta go because I don't want this to cut out on you. Kathy, that's been your reading. Like I said, it may or may not have resonated with every single Capricorn. Getting no fit nuts, but I do though, for real. I do because y'all about to hurt people. Okay, hurt people, hurt people. Okay? Still, thank you for visiting my channel. I'm not tripping or not terror. My name is Cockfrost, but you can call me the Get On Nine. Please hit like, subscribe, share with your friends. Again, info for private readings will be below the video. You can purchase your DU gear at thegetonnone.com, and I will talk to you later. Love you. Bye.